What's up guys, today is a really exciting day for Android, especially those that use Tasker. You are now able to use Google Now to execute Tasker tasks. This is really something that I've been waiting for for a long time. And especially those of you out there that use a Moto X or even a Nexus 5 can really take advantage of this. Now you will need root and it does use the exposed framework. So it is a module. Uh, essentially this module adds an API to the Google search app which is also known as Google Now. And it basically allows developers to make plugins that react to searches done in Google Search. So let me give you guys a quick demo of how this works. And uh, yeah, this is really cool stuff. So basically, if you're using a Nexus 5 or a Moto X, like I said, you could really take advantage. On the Nexus 5, the Google Edition launcher, of course, all you have to say is, okay, Google, turn on popcorn machine. And it works brilliantly, very easy to do. Of course, it does do a Google search. Don't worry about that. It's something that there is a workaround. And if you follow me on my Tasker tutorial channel, I will show you guys how to integrate this. It's very easy. Okay, Google, turn off office lamp. There you go. Okay, Google, turn on office lamp. So this really changes everything, especially those of you that own a Moto X because the Moto X is always listening. And one of the things that, I, I mean, when the Moto X came out, Google Now is cool, but I wasn't really thrilled about it just because I really don't use Google Now. Uh, or I do, but not like I would with my all my Tasker stuff that I do. But now, now that this integration works, Truly, the Moto X is probably my new phone. As a matter of fact, I ordered one already because this, again, changes everything. You are now able to just leave your phone down. Remember, the Moto X is always listening and you can execute task or task. Let me give you guys another demo of stuff that you can do, especially if you do some home automation stuff. Okay, Google, turn on computer. So I'm upstairs and as you can see, my thermostat is off and I'm gonna go ahead and execute a couple of commands. Okay, Google. Set house to heat. Okay, Google. Set house to cool. Okay, Google. Turn thermostat off. Okay, so I'm in my garage now and I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my lock. Okay, Google, lock garage side door. I'm gonna go ahead and move this over here so you guys can see it. Okay, Google, unlock garage side door. Now, because it is encrypted, it does take a little bit uh, compared to like lights and other things, but there you go. So as you can see, you can do a lot of pretty neat stuff, especially if you use Tasker a lot or if you do home automation like myself. So just imagine you own a Moto X, you're driving home. As you get close to your house, you say, okay, Google, unlock my front door or you know open the garage door and it automatically opens without you having to do anything so this is really like i said is something that i've been waiting for and i'm really excited as of right now this uh module only works with one command at a time so unlike auto continuous voice i could <clears throat> excuse me say about 25 commands at the same time i could say you know turn on my popcorn machine turn on my computer unlock the side door and it would execute all those commands at the same time as of right now you you can only do one at a time, but remember it's still in its infancy, it's still new. Just the fact that this is able to work is pretty mind blowing. And right now there's no card. So, you know, like for example, you know, as a Google now you're able to have different cards. That's not implemented yet, but imagine this, imagine you leave your house and then you have a card that says, you know, you left the front door unlocked or you left the light on and you can just from here, from your cards menu, you can go ahead and, you know, trigger a task to either turn off the light, turn it on or whatever it is that you, you know, your alarm that you want to execute. So very cool. I'm really excited about the development of this. But like I said, this really changes everything, especially for phones like the Nexus 5, but most importantly, the Moto X, because the Moto X is the 
true phone that could take advantage of all of this without having to actually turn the device on. So anyhow guys, if you like the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I will be doing a tutorial. And of course, if you guys follow me on my Tasker channel, my Tasker tutorial channel, which I will leave a link down below. This is where I teach you guys how to use Tasker, how to do all these neat things. So if you're not a follower, make sure you do subscribe to that. And again, until next time, adios. Open YouTube on my Find 5. Open Amazon on my Nexus 7. Open Granny Smith on my Nexus 10. Reboot my Nexus 10. Take a picture on my Nexus 7. Give it a second. There it is, taking a picture. So there you have it, a quick demo. There's so much you can do with this. You basically have full control of your devices.